Most smartphone batteries at power banks use lithium ion technology to generate power, but this chemical reaction can sometimes cause gas formation inside the battery, causing it to swell or even burst. There are several factors that can trigger gas formation, including overcharging, overcurrent, high temperature, physical damage, and poor build quality. So, how do you stop your battery from swelling? Well, you've come to the right place. Hi everyone, Earl here of Hugotech, and here are some tips to prevent your smartphone and power backs from loading. I know, I know, most of us sleep soundly with our device charging, but hear me out. Keeping your device plugged in after it reaches 100% battery level can stress the battery and cause it to degrade faster. Unplug your device once it reaches 100% or use a smart charger that stops charging automatically when full. Well, there are some gadgets out there that don't bother it being overcharged since they have sufficient tech to keep that stress out of the system, like Nintendo Switch for example. You can leave it plugged in the dock, like literally forever, and it will apparently leave no damage to the battery. However, that's not the case with most smartphones in the market. Overcurrent. Drawing more power from the battery than it can handle can be a real shocker. It can damage the battery cells and leave you powerless when you need your device the most. So let's avoid that, shall we? To keep the battery healthy, it's important to use compatible chargers and cables that match your device's specifications. I mean, you wouldn't wear shoes that don't fit right. So, same goes for your device. You can check the charger specification that comes with your device or look for chargers specifically designed for your device. Another tip to keep in mind is to avoid using the device while it's charging. Think of it like you're trying to run a marathon while you are still eating your breakfast. Not a great idea, right? Instead, wait until your device is fully charged before using it again. Avoid high temperature. So you know how we all love our devices, but they can be a bit sensitive at times. Well, one of the things that can really affect the delicate balance of your battery is exposing it to extreme temperatures. Basically, you don't want to cook or freeze your battery, well, it won't do any good. Keep your device from overheating, and avoid it leaving in direct sunlight or near fireplaces, ovens, or other source of heat. And as tempting as it might be to use your phone while it's charging, try to resist the urge since it will generate more heat and can potentially damage your battery in the long run. On the flip side, cold weather can also be a problem for your battery, so try not to leave your device out in freezing cold for too long. But meh, we're here in the Philippines, so cold weather isn't really an issue, unless of course you live in colder areas like Baguio. Avoid physical damage. Let's talk about dropping your device. I know sometimes it's like our heads having mind of their own and they just let go of our devices. But trust me, the floor is not a friendly place for your device's battery. It can cause internal short circuits that can seriously damage your battery. So let's agree to keep our devices away from hard surfaces, shall we? Now about piercing or opening the smartphone or the power bank housing, I mean, who in their right mind would do that, right? But just in case you were thinking of trying it out, let me stop you right there. It's a big no-no. Not only can it cause fire or explosion, but it's also not cool. To avoid all these potential issues, I suggest that you store your device in a protective case. It's like giving your device a warm and cozy hug. Plus, it can absorb and impact and keep your device safe from harm. Next up is avoid poor build quality. When it comes to buying electronics, it's always tempting to go for the cheaper option. But let me tell you, that's not always the best idea. Cheap knockoffs may use a substandard material or components, which can lead to gas formation or swelling for your device's battery. To avoid this, it's important to invest in reputable brands that have passed quality tests and certifications. Don't worry, you don't have to break the back to do this. Just remember, quality is a key when it comes to electronics. If you notice any sign of swelling such as bulging, cracking, leaking, or hissing sounds from your device, stop using it immediately and have it repaired by authorized service centers. Don't try to be a hero and fix it yourself unless you really want to end up with a missing finger or two. 
But let's not get too serious here. Maintaining your device should be a breeze. Just make sure to regularly clean them and keep them away from extreme temperatures or moisture. And by doing these, you will not only ensure the longevity of your device, but you'll also avoid any unnecessary trips to the repair shop. So remember, invest in quality and don't mess with battery swelling. Your device will thank you for it. And that wraps it up our tips on protecting your devices from swelling or bloating. Do you have your own ways on keeping your device's battery healthy too? Share them in the comment section below. I hope you enjoyed this video and if you find it helpful, be sure to drop a like, subscribe to our channel for more content, hit the bell icon so you don't miss any future uploads, and be sure to follow us on Facebook, TikTok, Instagram, and Twitter, and visit www.udirect.com for any latest tech news and reviews. This has been Aurel, and I'll catch you guys in the next one. Cutscenes. Then I play that, yes. Send call it.